pace. He puts it up. He gets it back. No, he doesn't. The USA come up with the basketball. 140 remaining. Germany coming up in the last couple of possessions. Halliburton past the read. Comes off the three-point line, and he is fouled. And now comes into play what you were talking about. They're over the limit, and the USA who's shooting, who are making their free throws are going to the line. And Jeff, this is great fundamental basketball for the United States. On the ball pressure, they look diver to diagonal. Jaron Jackson Jr. dove to the rim. He was covered and pulled in the help side for the backside. They skipped it, and Reeves gets to the free throw line. So Reeves, 16 points now here in crunch time. And gets the second one to go. Shooter's touch for Austin Reeves. Bucket to give them a oh, the pass. What an idea. Schroeder bounce pass behind the back to his uh, good friend Tice. That was the attempt. Look at that. Just went off of Jackson. Oh, there he goes. Oh! Four points. Is that the shot that's going to get Germany into the final? Here goes Bridges. Goes in the block from Isaac Bonga. Schroeder keeping Bridges off of him. Germany taking some time off the clock. Schroeder steps back. Count it! The Germans have taken a six point lead. Is there enough time for the USA? 38 seconds. Reeves soars in for the dunk. And oh, and a, a foul on Bunga. And the challenge is coming. The challenge. Gordy Herbert wants to challenge that call. I don't think he can, can he? I think it's a good call. And that, that is just not necessary for Isaac Bunga in that situation. I mean, Jeff, it's the only thing that can save the USA right now is turning it over. Steve Kerr holding on to his timeout here, trying to organize the United States for a late clock sideline play on the fly, taking advantage of this communication. Walk us out. Team on in. Let's we'll see. Four points, the difference. 33 seconds. Reeves. Edwards again. Oh, and it's back! Intended for Jackson. It goes out of bounds. They get it right back. The USA chewing towels. They're nervous. And now Maldo Low checks in. Additional ball handler. We're getting into the last shot clock possession. 24 seconds. Schroeder has it. Gets up the court. And Jackson commits the foul. I think USA need to get into a position where they put Germany on the line. Yeah, and the advantage you had earlier where you had fouls to give, now you've got to use your fouls quickly to try to get into the free throw game. Three looks from Hart. USA absolutely rocked against Italy in the quarterfinals. But they have faced a different level of competition tonight in the semifinal against Germany. Out of low. Franz Wagner. Schroeder gets it over to Oates. Oh, and they do force a turnover. Down four, the USA. They don't have to get a three. They got to get it up, though, quickly. They get it to Reeves. He puts it up. He misses. But Bancaro with the rebound. He misses. Reeves gets it. There's only a half a second left. There's a half a second left. And the USA's hopes of getting to the title game hanging by a thread. They are going to need a minor miracle right now to deny Germany. Excellent timeout for Cordy Herbert here to try to organize it. Look for them to advance the ball into the front court and throw the ball towards the United or towards their basket. And good effort here on the offensive boards for Boncaro. 
and then the putback from Reeves. Oh, all credit to Reeves. I mean, he hustled in after missing the three. And Halliburton and the USA players they beat Germany and Abu Dhabi. They did lose their game to Lithuania. They seemed to be back in flow against Italy, but we knew from the very beginning including when they played against Germany and Abu Dhabi, this was going to be a, a big opponent that they, they might have to clear. Yeah, and I think when you look at this game, even though points in the paint have kind of evened up 50 to 44, still for Germany, second chance points tonight, Jeff, 25 to 8 for the German team. Germany trying to get to the final for the first time in the FIBA Basketball World Cup. Andreas Ox has had the game of his life. So here's Germany in line, and again, throw the ball towards your basket. And then hits the Schroeder, he throws it up, and the Germans have done it! They have stunned the United States in the semifinals! Can you believe it? The USA, a lot of people thought they were going to make it back to the final. They fall 113-111. Jeff, what a great game. And the USA will play in the third place game against Canada. It'll be an all-American third place game, whereas Germany will go up against Serbia in the final. And I don't think there's any doubt about it. That's the best game in the FIBA Basketball World Cup. It came at the right time. Outstanding effort. You know, Germany was more consistent. You can see Lakers teammates. Lakers teammates. Austin Reed and Dennis Schroeder. All credit to Schroeder for bouncing back from a very difficult game. He heard the criticism, perhaps justifiably, and answered the best way possible.